Marseille were desperate to return to winning ways when they hosted a relegation to Thresen in the weekend's final game. OM had been Paris Saint-Germain's closest pursuers for much of the current campaign, but three draws in their previous four had seen them cede that position to Lens. Those who were presented with an excellent opportunity to reclaim second, though, through the combination of PSG's earlier victory over Lens and a visit from an Estac side that were winless in 13 league games and winless against Marseille since October 2012. And indeed, it took them under 90 seconds to open the scoring. Vitinha turning well and lashing his first Liga Ubrich's goal high into the roof of Gauthier Gallon's net. 85 seconds on the clock as the ball hit the net. Vitinha scores the fastest top flight goal for Marseille since André Pierre Gignac. That was 20 seconds in September 2014. Patrick Kisnobo may be shocked by the amount of space offered up by his defence. And having gone fairly close to a second a few times in the first half, OM did eventually double their lead five minutes before the break. Valentin Rongier stealing the ball in the trois half and slipping through Jengazunda, who steered the ball expertly into the far corner. Tenacious work from Rongier. And then a brilliant finish from the Turkey international to notch up just his third goal of the season. Marseille were unbeaten in their previous eight top flight matches against Tours, averaging 2.4 goals per game during that run. At the halfway point, this one was very much on course to follow the form book. To the second 45, and Owen would slightly increase that average of 2.4. Seb Kalasinac heading Undez Connor onto the bar, and Vitinha on hand with quick reactions for the rebound to turn his first Marseille goal into a first Marseille brace. Portuguese has struggled for playing time since joining from Braga in the January transfer window, and Alexis Sanchez invariably leading the line. This performance would have done his case for further inclusion, no harm at all. Himself should have added a force Not long after when he got a break of the ball on the edge of the box. The former Arsenal star caught his half volley all wrong. Frustration visible on the Chilean's face. They would eventually be a force, but it would go the way of Estac. Mavalde with a fine consolation in injury time, cutting back inside Isakabore and then finding the bottom corner. 11th of the season for the Guinea Bissau forward. Marseille frustrated to see a clean sheet slip through their fingers. But no real harm done. 3 1 would be the final score. A good day for Les Olympia as they leapfrog Lance back into second. 64 points is their second best tally ever after 31 games of a top flight season. To our meanwhile, now 10 points from safety, beginning to look set to leave said top flight.